Hello fellow retro seekers and welcome to another countdown here on Retro Needy. Today we are looking at 10 underrated animated movies from the 90s. Feel free to chime in in the comments if you remember these 90s gems or if you remember any others. Let's get started with number 10. Why it's a dog's life and I love it. Animated by Hanna Barbera, Rover Dangerfield is the story of a lovable Las Vegas dog, Rover, who, due to a jealous boyfriend, gets separated from his owner, Connie, and ends up being taken in at an animal farm. The titular character, Rover, was voiced by the famous comedian Rodney Dangerfield. No respect. No respect at all. His signature humor and delivery added to the film's comedic charm. Never, 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 never do it on a Christmas tree. Number nine, The Page Master. I'm a cartoon. The Page Master is a 1994 animated adventure film that blends live action and animation, starring Macaulay Culkin and Christopher Lloyd. In this story, a cautious boy's life gets turned upside down when he visits the library and gets transported inside the magical world of literature. The film is part live action, part animated, and it's very nostalgic to those who had the pleasure of viewing it as a child. Number 8. All Dogs Go to Heaven 2 is the sequel to Don Bluth's 1989 All Dogs Go to Heaven continuing the adventure of Charlie Barkin, a charming German Shepherd and his short-legged friend, Itchy. In this sequel, Charlie is voiced by Charlie Sheen, and in this movie, he and Itchy are sent to Earth to bring back Gabriel's horn. But Charlie ends up having an earthly love interest and ends up making a few decisions that send them in a few loops that bring them trouble later down the road. This film ended up inspiring an animated series spin-off that aired from 1996 to 1998. Number 7. Cats Don't Dance Hollywood, where the streets are paved with gold. Cats Don't Dance is a 1997 animated musical comedy film produced by Turner Feature Animation. It tells the story of a talented cat, Danny, who moves to Hollywood with dreams of becoming a movie star. But after upsetting America's sweetheart, Darla Dimple, he's in for a rough time in Hollywood. Despite its warm reception from critics and audiences, Cats Don't Dance had a limited theatrical release, which may have contributed to its relatively low box office performance. However, it has since gained a cult following and is appreciated for its humor, animation, and musical elements. Number 6. The Swan Princess This One Princess is a 1994 animated musical fantasy film produced by Nest Family Entertainment and Rich Animation Studios. It's a retelling of the classic Swan Lake fairy tale, telling the story of Princess Odette being captured by a wizard who turns her into a swan, and Prince Derek who must find her and proclaim his everlasting love to her before it's too late. The Swan Princess received generally positive reviews for its animation and music, while it may not have reached the same level of recognition as some Disney classics, it has developed a loyal fan base and is cherished for its fairy tale charm. Number 5. Fern Gully The Last Rainforest. Fern Gully The Last Rainforest is a 1992 animated environmental film set in a forest inhabited by fairies. One of the fairies, Krista, accidentally shrinks down a human named Zack, who helps the fairies fight against Hexes a malevolent spirit of pollution and destruction. The film is remembered for its strong environmental message and fun-loving characters, including Batty, voiced by the one and only Robin Williams. Humans don't have tails. They have big, big bottoms that they wear with bad shorts. They walk around going, Hi, Helen! Number 4. Anastasia Anastasia is a 1997 animated musical film produced by 20th Century Fox. It is inspired by the legend of Grand Duchess Anastasia Nikolaevna Romanov of Russia. Anastasia features a talented voice cast, including Meg Ryan as the voice of Anastasia, John Cusack as Dmitri, 
and Angela Lansbury as the voice of the Dowager Empress Marie. This movie became a commercial success, grossing over $140 million worldwide and becoming one of the most successful non-Disney animated films of its time. Its success contributed to a resurgence of interest in animated features not produced by Disney. Number 3. Balto Balto is a 1995 animated adventure film produced by Amblimation and distributed by Universal Pictures. The movie is inspired by the true story of Balto, a Siberian husky part of a sled dog team who played a vital role in delivering a diphtheria and toxin serum to Nome, Alaska. Balto employs a hybrid animation style that combines traditional hand-drawn 2D animation for the characters and a computer-generated imagery CGI, for the background, and a couple other sequences. This combination gives the film a unique visual appeal. This film has a special place in the hearts of those who appreciate stories of courage and determination. Number 2. The Rescuer is Down Under The Rescuers Down Under is a 1990 animated adventure film produced by Walt Disney Feature Animation. It's a sequel to Disney's 1977 film, The Rescuers. This film was a significant achievement for Disney because it was the first animated film to use the new computerized animation production system known as CAPS. This technology allowed for more intricate and visually impressive animation sequences. While the film received positive reviews, it did not perform as well at the box office as other Disney classics of the time. However, it has since gained a dedicated following, and it's appreciated for its animation, quality, and adventure-driven storyline. Before this list number one pick, here are some honorable mentions. Quest for Camelot, 1998. The King and I, 1999. The Iron Giant, 1999. DuckTales the Movie, 1990. We're Back, A Dinosaur Story, 1993. Rock-A-Doodle, 1991. Number 1, The Prince of Egypt. Second born, second place! Not for long! Yeah. The Prince of Egypt is a 1998 animated musical film produced by DreamWorks Animation. It retells the biblical story of Moses and the biblical book of Exodus. This movie was not only visually stunning, but also had an amazingly powerful musical score that even won an Academy Award with Mariah Carey and Whitney Houston's When You Believe. There can be miracles when you even if you're not religious, this movie is still quite enjoyable, depicting the story of a man trying to figure out where he belongs. The film grossed over $200 million worldwide, paving the way for DreamWorks Animation to become a significant player in the animation industry. Do you remember any other 90s animated movies worth mentioning? Let us know in the comments what we may have forgotten. And see you next time on Retro Needy.